Hey, it's just a reading here. Today is March 9th, 2024. The time for me is 2.36 a.m. This is a brand new Aries reading. No projection, a clear understanding, a truthful understanding now. This reading may resonate with you and it may not to take with it the rest. Only my angels and ancestors are allowed to this reading. I'm about to get ready and do for y'all. Be coming back here. If you know, welcome, sun, moon, and rising for Aries. I'm going to go ahead and tap into the energy for y'all. See what's going on. I'm going to waste no time. Let's see what the energy is like for y'all. See what's going on. First card for Aries. The Knot of Swords came out. Moving direct. Impatient. What are you moving fast towards? What is this? You got the Ten of Swords in reverse. Okay. You maybe you might not trust somebody here. Maybe surviving something here, something that happened. Maybe somebody swick, uh, swift and quick with their words. Let me more. It may cause you to go into the hermit here, want to contemplate by yourself, um, want to be alone. Some type of truth or trying to figure something out by yourself. The two of cups and the three of uh, pentacles came out. Maybe got something to do with love. I saw the ten of wands at the bottom. Some type of burden. Oh, You got the two of cups that came out in reverse now. So something is off. Some type of disagreement you had with somebody. Maybe it's causing you to go be quiet and be by yourself. Maybe something happened here where somebody don't trust you or you don't trust them. Maybe this knight of swords, um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius came off kind of kind of cold. Two of cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. They came at you a little crazy here. Devil wanted to come out. Shuffle this again. Something about a ten of cups, but you um, you see a happy ending with this person. Mary, maybe marriage. Giving them your last name. Hmm, they go to the five of wands. I, I knew I was gonna see the five of wands. Something about the five of wands. The argument. Some of y'all might have had an argument with this person. Seven of Pentacles, but you still want to grow with them. It was some type of disagreement here. So y'all had like a fight or something. Oh they flying out. Ace of Pentacles. Queen of Swords, right here at the bottom, the Four of Wands. All right. Tell me more about this Knight of Swords. Something is just moving too fast here. Maybe you and this person was moving too fast. That Five of Wands keep coming out. Maybe you and this person was moving too fast here. Maybe this could have been you moving fast.
You got this nine of swords in reverse. You may be recovering from something or facing a fear with this person. Something right here didn't go as planned, or maybe you maybe you were <clears throat> maybe you regretting doing something here that you shouldn't have did. Maybe you did something. Let's see. Maybe they did something. Yeah, that five of wands wanted to come out. Maybe you regret something that you said to this person. Y'all got into it. It was an argument. Y'all had words for each other. Y'all was saying some things to each other that y'all shouldn't have said. Ooh, y'all was arguing. This don't look too good. What was y'all arguing over, you and this person? Somebody trying to be a control freak, maybe a dictator, and you got, yeah, somebody here was being very controlling or very, like, brutal with their words. This could have been you or this person. It could have been the both of y'all. I'm looking, it seems like it was the both of y'all. Both of y'all got really mean and, and, and evil with y'all words. Said some really hurtful shit. Talk about the Ten of Swords. Now... You may be trying to escape this. Probably not trying to think about it. Yeah, because you still think of this person as home. Nine of Pentacles, comfort. Something about this person. Yeah, money here. You could build a foundation with this person money-wise. So maybe that's why you want to recover from the drama with this person. Whoever these people are. Yeah, this page of cups could be a page of cups. This could be a crush, somebody you got a crush on. Page of Cups is a person that has a crush and willing to give their love out and very young looking and shit, ready to go. So this could have something to do with y'all spirituality too. Y'all could be very spiritual and creative here. Both of y'all. This person, they, they got a crush on you. This water sign, Page of Cups. This could be somebody like a little younger than you. Maybe two years. I'm hearing two years, four years max. Whoever this person is, they got a crush on you. And they really like you. And they're like spiritually connected to you. Which is really good. I feel like this person probably didn't mean what they said. I feel like they said a couple of things too they shouldn't have said. You know, it happens though. Talk about the hermit. Maybe you don't like how this person was talking, though. With the hermit. Tell us more. Yeah, eight of wands. Things got... <laughs> maybe this person wanted maybe you were in hermit or you wanted to be alone and this person wanted to talk to you or y'all or something got sent out but it was like fast some swift movement like do it now hurry up messages or like things got sent out over the phone like energies and stuff right here and they were moving too fast 
you might have been alone and wanted to be by yourself for a little bit. And here they come talking crazy. Let's talk about the Eight of Wands. Somebody from your past. Somebody you sharing memories with. Somebody you familiar with. Yeah. You wanted to take like a, a new beginning with this person with the full card and adventure. This person may take you for a loop here. You go right there, Aries, with the Emperor. There you go on your own reading. This is you. You take leadership. Um, and this is your energy too. Like maybe you was fast to tell this person what's up. And didn't give a fuck. Came at them fast. It was a lot of fast energy here. Because you see a beginning with this person. You see something with this person. With the emperor here. Fatherhood. Authority. You have a high authority. And this person, they need to... Understand, too, they can't just be talking to you crazy because you have, like, a high authority and you going to do and say what you want to do because you you gonna, you take control of your life. This person could be sad, this cup energy, because right now y'all at a separation or something. Talk about the two of cups in reverse. Disharmony, breakup, a disagreement. Talk about this. Two of cups in reverse. The world, something changing. Maybe an ending between you and this person. A loss. Right here with the page of pentacles. Maybe y'all not finna talk for a while. Well. Knight of Pentacles. Overthinking, scared. Um, this could be them or this could be you. With the Knight of Pentacles being in reverse. Somebody scared. And they bored because they don't got your energy or you don't got their energy. But somebody scared here and they're overthinking. Cause this conflict and this this, you know, resentment. Talk about the Ten of Cups. This could be an empress that you're dealing with. Some, you know, um, energy, like a woman who's like, you know, like a mother, nurturing, caring woman. This could be the mother of your child or the emperor could be, you know, the father of your um your child. Because you do got the emperor here and the empress. So y'all both here. Um, but this empress right here, this could be you or the person that you're dealing with. They like they're de very dependent and they could be probably smothering over you. They're probably worrying about what you're doing, all up in your face about certain shit, trying to figure out things. Talk about the Empress being in reverse. The Empress in reverse could be a bit of a diva, so super diva-ish. She could be too much at times. Talk about the Empress.
she may go under judgment and reflect on something here. Or this may just be the both of y'all about to get ready and reflect. Yeah, something about temperance and balance here. Finding a, a meaning here. Some type of patience. Maybe y'all both don't have patience here. But she she or he, Empress in reverse, they gotta be you know, they gotta slow it down with the questions and being all smothering and being nosy and they need to reflect on how they, they say certain things here. They're gonna have to go under judgment because they can they reckless here. They could drink temperance right here. They need to find a middle ground here. And you do too, in order to make this work. Y'all both have to find some middle ground. Or it's going to be a loss. It's going to be, you know, it's not going to be this four of wands. If you... Let's talk about the seven of pentacles. Now we got to find some common ground. Seven of Pentacles. With justice, the law, cause and effect, truth. That's the truth right there. If y'all want to grow, y'all going to have to balance things out. Y'all want this Three of Cups in celebration, this joy. Y'all got to let go of the toxicity right here in these addictions and feeling... Like, you know, y'all could just run all over each other with the devil. It's not going to work. Y'all got to, you know, um, find some stability here with the Ace of Pentacles. I feel like y'all have like an ego uh, a problem, like an ego problem. Like, Wheel of Fortune it might be a karmic cycle. Already starting all this. seems like this is somebody that's new. With this Ace of Pentacles. Talk about this person, Ace of Pentacles. King of Pentacles, yeah, wealth, success. If y'all want this, y'all gonna have to drop y'all addictions. Y'all could be very playful, but then, you know, it's a lot of times it's not time to play. You got the chariot cancer energy. You got to find a direction. Get back into controlling and having willpower of finances and stability with mental and physical health. And y'all need to get y'all some sleep. I think you and this person, y'all need to rest for a bit. Recuperate. You guys got to heal. Take a break. I feel like if this, if this, you know, is supposed to work out, you're supposed to let it come naturally and take a break. Don't force nothing here. Just take a break. You could tell this person too. I feel like y'all going to be holding on and y'all going to be separated for a while. So if y'all take a break and rest, y'all going to be separated. But I feel like y'all going to still be holding on to each other. Talk about the Queen of Swords. Queen of Swords could be trapped here, feeling isolated, helpless, feeling like a victim. But they not a victim, okay? They done said some shit, so. But I guess this is how they feel. This is not your energy, but this is how this person is feeling. They feeling like a victim right now, or, you know.
there in the Nine of Cups. They could be heartbroken. They could be like a troublemaker, like a little player here and moody with this unquieted love. It's water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. What else about this person with the magician? This person could be like out of touch. They could be doing spell work too, trickery with illusions and stuff. So you be careful of this person. They could be a little, <laughs> they look like they could be a little crazy. This person's a little crazy, Aries. And I told y'all this little, you know, whoever y'all talking to, this little person y'all talking to, they a little troublemaker here. Tell me more about this person. I want to know more about this little younger person you fucking with. Hmm. seem to keep you like with a lot of energy this person ain't boring that's for a fact all right so tell me why the um the magician is here in reverse where's all these illusions and so I got seven swords death end of a cycle it's okay so y'all might be letting go of each other because of these illusions and confusions and yeah somebody about to walk away this look like you or this is either going to be them walking away somebody gonna find a new path or because they it's a failed attempt here maybe something happened maybe somebody about to get abandoned it's about to be a lot of disappointment here. Oh, shit. Things are finna hit the fan for this. Damn. And it just started. Looks like it. Talk about this devil with the addictions and all that. Five of Cups. Hope, forgiving, moving on. Y'all might forgive each other and just move on here. Yeah, maybe it's not going to work. Yeah, because the battle torn tired here. You already kind of getting burnt out with this person. Nine of Wands, it's your energy. Three of Wands, you probably about to get ready and go somewhere else. A different opportunity here. Yeah, because you have like morals and ethics about yourself. Maybe this person is just like not up to part. You may need to heal for a while. You kind of defensive too and just tired of this fighting because you guys been fighting. Tell me more about this little troublemaker, Page of Cups. Tell me more about him. This Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio that you're dealing with. Yeah, y'all about to get in and have a tower moment. About to probably get somebody about to get their pride, their ego broken here. Y'all about to fall up out of this tower. And that's the truth with the sun. But just think positive, though. Maybe something may fix this, and maybe it may go back to this nine of cups and this six of pentacles. But y'all may need to go through a tower moment right now. 
with the star helping rejuvenate spirituality. Yes, yeah, some of y'all gonna have to go through a tower moment in order to get back to like, I guess, liking each other, loving each other. Give me a kipper. Let's see what's going on. And then we're gonna see what they wanna say to you. Here go this main female. This could be you, Aries woman, or this could be um, that woman, Aries male. Wealthy man, this looks like you or either them. So there y'all go right there. Somebody want to give a gift to somebody. So my birthday could be coming up. Y'all at a distance or y'all about to be at a distance. But y'all going to be thinking about each other though while y'all gone. Poverty's here. Somebody could be like kind of broke or don't have a lot. Yeah, water sign right here. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, cycle, something. Fake karma, something ending, something beginning. So, uh-oh. Told y'all. Here you go right here. Fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Here you go, Aries. I see luck is on your side. Be careful of someone being sneaky. This person could be sneaky. And you've been bewitched. This person put a love spell on you. Maybe they're lying about this spell work that they did. Somebody put a spell on you. Maybe you may be messing with a blue eye, yeah, so. I don't know, or somebody put a spell on both of y'all. Like y'all both like each other. We wanna go ahead and see. Yin Yang Oracle. Disharmony triggers and conflict, yeah, y'all got into it. This was a bad argument. Yeah. Y'all could both be confused here about something. They could be confused about something. Soul ties and reunion came out in reverse, but I'm going to take it up. Y'all could be soul ties. Oh, shit. Person love them some of you. Somebody need to hear heal they inner child here. Yeah, something about control. It's like y'all both want control over each other. This woman got her heel on this man's head. Like, I'm in control. You're not in control. I'm in control. You're not in control. So that's what it's looking like. It's like y'all got control issues. Y'all both want to be in control. And... Oh.
You could also put a spell on this person too. I'm hearing that somebody from the Caribbean. You may be closed off or guarded to this person, but you still want a family or a home with this person commitment. This person fulfills you. Whoever this little firecracker is, you hot too. Let me see what they want to say to you. Let me see. They do want to talk to you, Aries. They want to say something to you. So let's see what they got to say. We're going to pull four of these. See what they got to say. See what they got to say. Let's get into it. What do they want to say today? The weeks have been going by fast. What do you want to say to Aries? I'm scared of rejection. Okay, so they're scared of rejecting. They're scared of you rejecting them. What else? You triggered me. Okay, so you triggered them, yep. Yeah? What else you want to say to Aries? Oh, they obsessed with you already, Aries. What else? Last one. Please do what's best for your heart. They want you to do what's best for your heart. And I was hurt by you. You must have said something to this person. You might have let their ass have it or something. Life without you is hopeless, dark, and depressed, and I miss your life. They miss talking to you. You bring them, like, happiness. But look like y'all may go into a separation right now because look like you ain't having it. I'm not having it, buddy. Will Aries and their person be okay? Let's see. Let's see. Will y'all be okay? Will Aries and their person be okay? Let's see. Will you guys be okay? Y'all not seeing out of eye, though. It's back to control. Control. Let's see. Ooh. It said unlikely right here. One more. What's going to happen to Aries and their person? I see romance. What's about to happen to Aries and their person in the near future? Okay, so we don't know yet. It said unlikely here and in the near future. I don't know what that means, but. I don't know, Aries. Let's get y'all a Bible scripture card and we're going to go ahead and get up out of here. Let's see what the man above got to say. How about this little whore dude? Thank you. And it says right here, ask and you shall receive that your joy may be full. Okay. Ask for what you want. You'll receive it. Just pray every day. Keep the faith. I don't know what's going on with you and this person, Aries. It look like y'all, you know, maybe having y'all little differences and maybe going through it and not seeing eye to eye. But look like it may be a separation here um, coming very soon between you and this person. Maybe starting today. Tomorrow or already start, but look like you ain't really feeling this person's energy. I don't know what it was, but you not feeling them. They not feeling you right now. I may need to take a little break and just like mellow things out. I'll talk to you when I talk to you type of thing. Until next time, Aries. Bye.